nominations for Best Play are Angels Fall by Lanford Wilson, a work which raises the question of what manner of person one ought to be in the face of nuclear apocalypse. Night Mother by Marsha Norman is about the choice to commit suicide. It is about the contemporary life and what gives it or fails to give it value. Plenty by David Hare. Set against the decline of Britain after World War II, this play chronicles the loss of control of, a, of an idealist whose world was not what she had foreseen. Torch Song Trilogy by Harvey Feierstein is a devastatingly comic play about love and the merciless mayhem love wreaks. And the winner is This is a stupendous and miraculous moment, and I would like to accept this in memory of Jane Chambers and Billy Blackwell. And in honor of all my brothers and sisters. And I would like to express my deep gratitude to the nominating committee and the voters, to Harvey Firestein, who wrought much more than he knew. To Peter Pope, our director, who put the magic in with his hands and his heart. To the company, past and present, God bless them all. And lastly, but most importantly, to the one person who believed and followed the dream from the very beginning, who never said, you're crazy, it can't be done, and I refer to my partner and my lover, Lawrence Lane. Everyone was so scared I was going to say something very embarrassing to you all. I mean, Mel Gus out prayed that I would win the Tony just so I could say something embarrassing. Um, I can't. Uh, we started in the basement of La Mama uh, with one-act plays. The Glines is the only theater in America that would put this show on. They, they mortgaged an oriental rug in their living room to do it. <laughs> we opened for an eight-week limited engagement, could not give a ticket away for three weeks. Here we are tonight. Oh, my God, it's ringing. Good night.